Insects were the first animal to evolve flight next or the pterosaurs, the first largest vertebrates to fly took to the skies about 215 million years ago. These creatures were neither birds nor bats. They belonged to a group of flying reptiles called pterosaurs. The smallest of these aerial predators was the size of a sparrow. The largest had a wingspan that rivaled that of an F-16 fighter jet. Many possessed heads larger than their bodies, making them, in essence, flying jaws of death. Pterosaurs patrolled every ocean and continent on Earth. No animal in the Mesozoic would have been safe from their gaze. Unlike dinosaurs, which are survived today by birds, pterosaurs left behind no living descendants. As a result, all that paleontologists know about pterosaurs comes from the fossil record. Some pterosaurs, like the pteranodon, had crests on their heads that could be up to one meter. Some pterosaur species lived nearby water while some were terrestrial. The terrestrial ones fed on carcasses, baby dinosaurs, lizards, eggs, insects and other animals. The marine pterosaurs ate fish, squid, crab and other shellfish, with an 11 to 12 m wingspan, Quetzalcoatlus is the largest flying organism ever known and is as tall as a giraffe when on the ground. Even though they could fly and were predators themselves, they were hunted too, being preyed upon by theropods. Along with dinosaurs and many other species, pterosaurs went extinct about 65 million years ago. If you want to see more of our content, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel.